I'm Anil Kumar and in this video I'm going to discuss with you rank of word. We have other topics also about rank of word which is how to find rank of word with or without repetition, how to find the word with the given rank and shortcut methods to find rank of word in the following videos. First let's understand the meaning of rank. It really means position of word that is what rank is let me take an example before getting into the definition let's take a simple word let's say cat now it has three letters in it with these three letters how many words meaningful or meaningless can we make that is where the permutation comes in right so basically we have three positions to fill in and as you know from permutations here we can put any of these three letters so so we have we can put three once we place one letter in this position we are left with two and then with one so if we count we can get three times two times one which is six words now the rank is out of these six words if we arrange them in alphabetical order as it is done normally in dictionary where will cat appear in which position and that position number is called rank of the word right okay let's go back to it once again let's make a list what words can you make from cat cat okay alphabetically we should begin with a right so a comes first so we begin with a once a has been placed next comes c and then t now that is not the word we are looking for the other word could be a t c correct so two words done out of those six once we are done with beginning with a we can start looking for words beginning with c so we get c a t well that's the word we need perfect so we say that the rank of cat is three so since it appears in third position right amongst this list of six we're not really concerned how many but where it appears so we say rank of cat is is three right so that is how we have figured out rank of a word so i hope with this uh, you have understood what we are trying to find when we say rank of a word. Let me take another example, right? We will take very simple examples. The other word is anil, A-N-I-L. Now, let us go to four letters. It becomes more complicated. So, what we do here is uh, we will adopt a better method. Let us first figure out alphabetically how to arrange these uh, letters. So alphabetically, A comes first, okay. So A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, right. So that is the order in which they will appear in dictionary, right. So if I'm looking for combination of words which can be made where order is important using letters A and I, L, I should start making with A, right. So if I start making with A, well, I hit A, A, Anil, that's good. So it matches. I have to follow it up with three more letters to match the later three, right? Next comes I. Okay, as soon as I put I, I know it's not matching with Anil. So that means whatever I place here, it will come before anil, right? It will come before anil. I have two letters to place, right? And therefore, we could write this as there are two factorial words which are coming or appearing before anil. 
when I place I perfect okay now starting with a which we kind of got already so I can say well we have at least got one of them let me strike it off but I didn't work let's start with L so the next letter after A will be L again well that doesn't match but still we have more words to go starting with AL two positions to fill no repetitions two factorial right AL IN and NI those are the two words you know it right correct so two more words and then I will try to look for a n a n perfect it matches so we got n so so we got n now we'll go back to the list a we have already got this we got so we go i perfect i it matches and we're left with l so that is the next word and the next word matches perfectly with an l so we say that the order of anil should be its position from the combination of words arranged alphabetically made from the letters in anil, right? So two factorial really means what? Let's count how many words have come before anil. So two factorial is two, two factorial is two, and the position is plus one. So we get the rank as 2 plus 2 plus 1, which is equal to 5. And we say rank of anil is 5, right? So I hope uh, you are getting to understand what it is. So basically, we have touched upon what is rank of the word and how to find rank of word with or without repetition oh okay so so we'll take a few more words uh, in the following videos so i'll take a word like toronto well that becomes complicated there are repetitions right there are repetitions so we will see how to find rank of such words in coming videos but i hope you have understood the method and the meaning of rank of word and also how it is linked with permutations and like how do we get rank of word and permutations linked together now this two factorial three factorial what we are talking about or three times two times one which we have talked about is part of counting principles counting the number of words which can be formed from the letters in the given word which will come before the word, right? So that is what it is. We'll explore further. I hope you understand and appreciate the concept. Let's take a few examples and move from there. Thanks for watching. Feel free to post your comments, share my videos. Thank you.